Hi, it's Lee from ColouringQueen.net and I'm super excited to show you this book today. When I first seen it on Twitter, I fell in love with it and I squeaked like the guinea pigs themselves and I knew I had to have it. It's just so cute. The cover is so pastel pretty and it's got these cute little guinea pigs that are all fluffy on the cover here. It's just so gorgeous. It just reminds me of all those lovely gelato ice cream displays. The cover is absolutely stunning. Now it's about 21 centimeters by about 21 and a half centimeters across and we've got this gorgeous cover that's like a matte laminate. Nothing really to cover color in there. And this girl's got a guinea pig uh, website, which again is all pastel pretty and absolutely gorgeous with her guinea pigs on it. On the back, we've got the cute little guinea pig again, and I should find out their names. Uh, and excuse my voice, I'm a bit husky, I've got a virus. Often uh, when I get the envelope and it's super cute, I always keep it. So have a look at the envelope that this arrived in. Isn't that adorable? It's printed with a little guinea pig on it and a little envelope. Isn't it gorgeous? Now this book is only available from the UK, but it does ship really well. It is beautifully packed uh, in that envelope. There's a lovely card, um, hard card packing on it um, as well as the envelope and it's also wrapped in tissue paper and bubble wrap so um, it flew across the world to Australia with no problems at all so you can only get this one from the artist website in the UK and the links uh, to buy that are below the video so let's look inside my gorgeous guinea pig colouring book which is called the magical guinea pig colouring book so on the inside cover we've got this lovely pastel pink and white spots, super cute. And then our title page which is reflective of our front cover so we can colour that in. Now the paper is white and it's not quite a medium quality, it's a little bit less but it is absolutely adorable. We've got our forward by the artist and then this gorgeous nameplate page. And as you can see, the illustrations have been printed on single-sided paper so that you can use whatever medium you choose to. And here we've got another little message from the artist and this is also a great spot to test out your mediums and see how they work. Um, particularly with the paper and your particular artistic style. So let's look at these gorgeous little illustrations and they're so cute, I'm just in love with them. So we've got the little guinea pig with his watering can, watering the garden. Oh, it must be a little girl guinea pig, she's got a hat with flowers on it. And see the illustrations have been mainly placed away from the spine so they've been positioned well on the page. We've got the mermaid guinea pig, so cute. The guinea pig with balloons. And uh, this girl also does um, all of the guinea pigs, etc. as little stickers and cards and key rings. Um, if you look at her website, it's just so, if you're into pastel things, it is just so deliciously pretty, you virtually want to lick it. Um, it's just so gorgeous. Um, and we've got little cakes and a little strawberry teapot and all sorts of gorgeous things there as well. Lovely little guinea pig. Guinea pig in a hot air balloon, as guinea pigs do. And I love this one. Look at all these beautiful flowers. And we've got different types of flowers. And so even though it's about a cute topic like these guinea pig fairies, um, the artwork on it is really good. And it's really not only cutesy, but also really good with a nice variety of different images to colour in. Now it's also suitable for all ages and colourists of all skill types because the line work is a medium black weight so it makes it pretty easy to see and also there's a lot of large open spaces for colourists that might have visual 
or motor skill impairment. And look at these ones, he's eating all the cotton candy. Aren't they adorable? So often when I see something online, I get all excited about it and then it turns up and I'm a bit mm, about it. But this one, it's love at first sight. And see so how some images are more detailed than others. So it might be a good one to share with your child and let them have some of the more outline based illustrations while you concentrate on the more detailed illustrations or even vice versa. And we've got all these butterflies with lovely little patterns on them to colour in. And the great thing about guinea pigs is that they can be any colour that you like. They come in such a huge variety of colours, guinea pigs. Look at these ones at the park. <laughs> Aren't they adorable? <laughs> the piggy blues. That's cute. There's a lot of images here that would look great if you added in a background, some maybe pan pastels or some chalks or something and give it a bit more artistic oomph. But most of them don't really need a background because they've got lots of things happening on the page. Isn't this adorable, witchy guinea pig? This is me. Santa guinea pig. How adorable. Oh, that is just too cute for words. And then we've got the pink and white spots to end the book. So as you can see, it's absolutely packed full of illustrations printed on single-sided paper. So put a piece of paper underneath it so you can use whatever medium you want. 
the illustrations vary between more simple images to more complex images. The outline on all of the images is a nice black, very easy to see and a super super cute book. It's only available from the UK, comes in this gorgeous envelope with a cute little guinea pig on it which is so super cute. And with mine I also received a little card which was again super cute and one of these pretty little things as well. So with mine I also got a cute little thank you card and I also got this lovely little um, note here. And you just see how pretty this is. It is just gorgeous. I'm going to put that on my cork board next to my computer because that's where I keep all my pretty things. So until next time, thank you for watching. You can purchase this link from the artist's website below this video. Until next time, happy colouring.